For this story, we're talking about kids in foster care. It's a challenge to find enough homes for the kids that need them in the communities in which they live. But one county in Virginia has teamed up with two other counties. It's a unique partnership that's giving kids homes in their own communities. It's worked so well, a Virginia House bill passed that encourages what you're about to see in this story. We are um, constantly thinking outside the box on how we can give children the best possible outcome, and that's to be raised in a family. Heather Linkus is a supervisor at Montgomery County Department of Social Services. They've been able to keep the children in the county or close by thanks to a partnership with Giles County and Floyd County. If a child needs a home, they can go to any of the three counties. Linkus says it's been a success. Montgomery County, um, much like many of the other counties in the New River Valley, um, it's just a different culture. And so moving to a larger city, kind of like Roanoke City, um, becomes a bit of culture shock. Um, school systems are, are larger. Service providers are different. Uh, it's just a bigger area. Um, maybe not as many mountains. It's everything. I mean, honestly, just to have families in three different counties that are so close, it makes it so much easier for all of us. Melissa Morgan works with the families. Keeping kids local help means stability for the kids, also helps with visitation with parents. Um, you want them to have normalcy. The more moves that you have with a child, the more trauma it causes. Currently, there are less than 60 kids in foster care across all three counties, but Montgomery County has a lot of teens. So offering them the opportunity to have homes within their own community where they've already had many, many years of school with their peers that they consider their best friends or they're involved in sports teams through their schools, we want to allow them to continue to do those things. But to do that, they need foster parents. We know that everybody does want the smaller kids, but honestly, teenagers, they need love too. Um, and there is abundance of them. We are having to go all over the state. I have kids in Richmond. I have kids in Northern Virginia. Honestly, if we could keep them all local, that is a big priority for us. Right now, they say they also don't have enough homes to take kids ages 12 and up. And really, there's always a need for foster homes. Be sure to subscribe to Solutionaries to see all our latest videos right here on YouTube.